before we get started with this video, I now sell merchandise. So if you're interested in buying a t-shirt or a mug, I have a link to my store in the description. I really appreciate anybody that purchases any one of my products. What's up guys, it's Jermaine from Shuffle Those Hogs, back with another video. And about half of my collection is currently in brumation. I'm sorry I didn't make a brumation video earlier, but this is my setup right here. You can see I got a towel over it and I got these racks that I pulled out that I really don't need. So we'll just see how my setup is. And as you can see, these are the guys that I have in formation. I have it set at 50 degrees. And this is like an Insigna cooler. And here they are. They're in Cocoa Core in sand um i actually have four of my baby hog noses let me close this up right here these are the guys that didn't eat i have them all in this one container let's open it up for you guys to see here's one of them it's a little female right here and the other ones or you can see their bellies are under here. Two Wombas and uh, another one. All right, let's close this up. Put them back in. As you can see, they're all looking good. This is my super arctic super conda. As you can see, he's buried. This is my arctic conda head Mai Tai. This one right here is I'm not even sure. Oh, this is a uh, curry down here. The 50% head leucistic. Yeah. All right, so let's get a peek at the ones that are not in brumation, so. Mainly my babies. This one right here is my male Woma. He's currently in shed, so he should be shedding either today or tomorrow. I know he's going to look amazing. This is my female Woma. My favorite one. I can smell the poop. Got to clean that out. So I'm done filming. So right here is another female. More along the lines of the granite jungle has that nice bold pattern. Really cool looking female. Let's see what we got down here. We got this really nice male. He'll be going to Canada in the spring. Really cool dude. He's almost like a goldish color. A goldish yellow green color. Excellent appetite. We have this little guy right here. He doesn't have any yellow in him. I'm, so I'm going to actually hold him back for a while just to see if that color develops. He's also has been a picky eater. Um, he's skipped his last three feedings. But I'm just going to hold on to him to see if that color develops as he ages. This one right here is one of my favorite males. He's also in shed. Um, he should be shedding today or tomorrow as well. I think he's going to be one of the most uniquely colored um, hog noses I have. I think he's going to be really, really light yellow and light brown. Really like this guy. Right here, we have this one. He actually shed, uh, I want to say earlier last week, so... Really nice example of um, Lemon Ghost Outcross. He's starting to get some yellow in his background, but as you can see, those uh, nice light brown saddles. He looks really good after his first shed. So he's going to continue to um, increase his yellow pigment as he ages and he sheds out. He's already been sold. We have this right here. Here's my Arctic albino, I mean my albino conda, 66% 66 head, 
Sable. Got from John Rice that Fathom Hogs. This right here is my Arctic Sable Conda Het Albino Female. Got from Jeff Gelwood. This is my male Mai Tai, so a visual toffee and sable. Got from Motor City Hogs. Got some attitude. We got my pure Lemon Ghost Woma, female. Also from Jeff Gelwood. Look at this snake that pooped in the water dish. Definitely got to throw that out. This is my Arctic 100% head albino female. She's also been sold. All right, and let's move on down here. We have the noodle. So he's just an albino hog nose. Looking for food. I'm gonna feed you tomorrow, my boy. Let's get you back in that cage. And then last, we have my Arctic Conda Het Mai Tai female. She'll be ready, not this coming season, but the season after that. I will be using my male. Um, Arctic Conda had my tie. He'll be ready this season. I'll be breeding him to my Arctic Conda, uh, which is tofu. So hopefully we can get some super Arctic super condas. 50% head my tie. She's also 50% head lavender as well as the male. So that's going to be pretty cool. And that's about it. Everybody else is in brumation. And I now have a Patreon account for those who want to support me even further. Here you will have access to exclusive videos, giveaways, as well as discounts. The link will be in the bottom in the description. And if you purchase Repi links, feel free to use the discount code SHOVELHOGS to receive 5% off of all purchases.